I want you to use your imagination for a second. I don't know who you are or what you do, but I'm going to assume you're someone who suffers from distractions. I do too. In fact, most of the world does, especially if you have the luxury of being able to use modern technology. It's a gift, yet also a curse. But here's the problem. If you don't get a grip of yourself, you're going to waste the most precious time you currently have. This video is as relevant to you as it is to me. I want you to feel inspired after watching this video. Because life is inspiring, and we'd be fools not to make the most of it. 10,000 hours. Let's talk about the 10,000 hour rule. This idea was made famous by the author Malcolm Gladwell. His argument is that it takes 10,000 hours of intense focus to achieve mastery in any field. We won't poke holes in the specific numbers. I think this is a fairly safe estimate. So, how long is 10,000 hours? It is roughly 417 days, 60 weeks, 14 months. In other words, just over a year. With that said, you aren't going to spend an entire year just doing one thing. You need to eat. You need to sleep. You need to engage in other activities that make the human experience worthwhile. But one of the main things you should be doing with your time is mastering a skill. It doesn't matter what it is necessarily, but sadly some skills are more valuable than others. This is why it's important to pick something that can be monetizable. You might love surfing more than life itself. That is a passion which can be turned into a business. The only problem is your potential would be limited because of the nature of the niche. Whereas if you chose to pursue marketing as your passion, your earning potential is literally unlimited. Why? Because someone who's good at marketing is more valuable than someone who can catch a big wave in the eyes of businesses. Sorry, but it's true. Either way, it's important you find the skill you want to master as fast as possible. You can't afford to waste any time. Distractions. We're plagued by distractions. Every TV channel is hoping to keep your attention hostage. Every single website and social media app is designed to keep you on their platforms for as long as possible. Your video games are addictive and constantly occupy your thoughts. In short, we're in trouble. But the good news is we're not doomed. There are things you can do to limit distractions. It's not easy, but is definitely doable. The key at the start isn't to add positive habits. You first need to start removing bad habits. You can start by leaving your phone outside your bedroom at night, then gradually move to deleting apps, maybe even selling your television. These may seem like extreme suggestions to you, and if you want these things in your life, you can keep them. All I'm saying is, you can't afford to be distracted. You can't be one of those people who waste 10,000 hours and then has the audacity to say, you didn't have time, you did have time, you just wasted it on crap that doesn't matter. Youngster, you may feel like you can afford to waste time right now. You're young, right? You'll have time five years from now. But here's the problem. If you don't start building now, five years is going to fly by. I mean it. I'm 24 now and turning 25 in April. But I still remember being 18 as if it was yesterday. But it wasn't yesterday. It was six years ago. Back then I thought I had time to waste, so I did. I became a drug addict. I spent hours every day binging bad shows on Netflix. I went out every night drinking and partying. Now I look back at all the wasted time and regret every second of it. I don't want you to make the same mistakes. I'm lucky I was able to snap out of it. But it took me a while. I didn't get my life in order until I was 22. That's right, I spent four years of my life wasting away. Four years, gone in a flash and with nothing to show for it. Don't make this mistake. You'll regret it for the rest of your life. It doesn't matter how old you are right now. You could be 15 or you could be 30. Stop everything you're doing in the present and start looking towards your future. I'm lucky to still be quite young. If I hadn't woken up until I was 30, I'd be in big trouble. Now that I'm aware of how precious time is, I'm confident I'll be a millionaire by 30. Why? Because I'm guarding my time like a bloodthirsty pit bull. It's the most precious asset I have, and it's your most prized possession too. Don't waste it. You only get one life, you might as well start living it. I hope this video made you want to run through a brick wall. Subscribe our channel for more content like this. Have a successful day.